Hey Facebook, it's Jeremy again here to give you guys another update on our, wa our Water's Edge Africa exhibit. Um, we brought you guys into the Hippo building today. As you can see, uh, there is a lot of activity going on around here. If you guys can't hear us, it's because it's really loud in here. We've got a, a lift right behind the camera going on today as well as generators. So we're going to get to it. We're going to show you guys some of the cool stuff that's been happening in here. Uh, starting off first with, this is the entrance to the building. So when you guys come into the Hippo building, this is what you'll see. You guys will actually be coming over those two footers that you see outside there. It's going to be a giant wide pedestrian bridge that's over a small pool with a waterfall cascading down from the Hippo pool into there and underneath. So then you walk through a big garage door that's right behind me here to come into this plaza space. And then as soon as you come in and you go over to your right here, you're going to have a 19 foot long viewing glass that's actually going to have the hippos in the pool down below you right there. And as you can see, there's a lot of construction crew working on it right now. This is where they're forming up the bottom of the pool. And the sides you see these two gentlemen working on right now, that's actually the outside part of our lemur island. So our lemurs, ringtail lemurs, are going to be hanging out on that island. Hippos in the pool space down here and they're both gonna have options to go outside. So just over here, where you can see a bunch of backhoe equipment outside, that's actually gonna be, there's an outdoor space to our lemur island, so it'll be half in the building, half out of the building, and then the pool that's surrounding the whole thing. So it's gonna be really exciting. Uh, we got an underwater shift for our hippos right down there. I'm not sure if you can see that one or not. Um, and then on the other side, we'll have an actually above water shift for the hippos to go outside as well. We're gonna have some underwater viewing ga or uh, shifting gates, which is gonna be really exciting so that we can uh, have one pool, but divide it into many spaces for all the different hippos we might have. Over there, where, um, where all of this kind of comes up and you see the concrete, that's gonna be an elevated space. The concrete hasn't been poured yet, but that's gonna be the land space indoors for all of our hippos. Those bollards you see over there are, are um, it's going to be our indoor training space. We really wanted to be able to provide the same type of training experience that you guys got to see in our old building. So we replicated that in a different way over there. We're going to have a scale built into the ground so we can weigh those hippos on a daily basis if we need to. And even more exciting, just across the way, we actually have a scale that will be in the floor for the visitors to stand on when you guys come and you can see how many of you it takes to weigh as much as a hippo. So that's going to be really, really fun. And then as you go all the way to the other end of the building there, um, we got more hippo holding space. And then we also have where the warthogs and our guinea fowl are going to live. So we do have warthogs. You guys met Penelope and Alexander a while back. Um, and then we're going to have guinea fowl. Um, and they are all actually going to be living outdoors with our hippos outside. So they're going to get to go. They'll live over there indoors uh, at night and in the winter when it's too cold. They'll shift out that into the building and they'll run all the way outside and have this entire expanse of space to play in. So we're really looking forward to introducing you guys to some more of the animals in one of our next updates. You guys are going to get to meet our lemurs um, who are actually here living in Monkey Pavilion. So we're really excited to show you that. Uh, but we wanted to give you this cool look of all the busy work that's going on. Now that they've got walls up in this building, if you come to the zoo, it's really hard to see the progress. But they are hard at work, as you can see. Tons of people on property work in their hardest to be able to make this exhibit come to life for us so that we're open this summer. So a lot more work to do, but they're making really good progress. So let's pray for some good weather. And we want to thank you guys for coming out and supporting us. And we look forward to seeing you guys this summer. Thanks.